Present simple Structure and usage The present simple is used to express daily routines and habits. Adverbs of frequency such as usually, sometimes, rarely, etc. are often used with the present simple. This tense is often used with the following time expressions always, usually, sometimes, etc. every day, on Sundays, Tuesdays, etc. Basic construction Positive Subject plus present tense plus object s plus time expression Frank usually takes a bus to work. Negative. Subject plus do slash dish plus not don't slash doesn't plus verb plus object s plus time expression. They don't often go to Chicago. Question. Question word plus do slash dish plus subject plus verb plus object s plus time expression. How often do you play golf? Present continuous for action at the moment. Structure and usage. One use of the present continuous tense is for action that is occurring at the moment of speaking. Remember that only action verbs can take the continuous form. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. At the moment. Now. Today. This morning slash afternoon slash evening. Basic construction. Positive subject plus b plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression she's watching tv now negative subject plus b plus not isn't aren't plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression they aren't having fun this morning question Question word plus b plus subject plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. What are you doing? Present continuous for current projects. Structure and usage. Use the present continuous to describe projects and actions that are happening around the present moment in time. Remember that these projects have begun in the recent past and will end in the near future. This usage is popular for talking about current projects at work or hobbies. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. At the moment. Now. This week slash month. Basic construction. Positive subject plus b plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. We're working on the Smith account this month. Negative subject plus b plus not isn't aren't plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. He isn't studying French this semester. Question Question word plus b plus subject plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. Which account are you working on this week? Present continuous for scheduled events. Structure and usage. One use of the present continuous tense is for scheduled future events. This usage is especially useful when talking about appointments and meetings for work. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. Tomorrow, on Friday, Monday, etc. Today, 
this morning slash afternoon slash evening. Next week slash month. In December, March, etc. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus B plus verb plus ing plus object S plus time expression. I'm meeting our CEO at 3 o'clock this afternoon. Negative. Subject plus B plus not isn't. R plus verb plus ing plus object S plus time expression. Shirley isn't attending the meeting tomorrow. Question Question word plus B plus subject plus verb plus ing plus object S plus time expression. When are you discussing the situation with Tom? Past simple. Structure and usage. The past simple is used to express something that happened a past point in time. Remember to always use a past time expression, or a clear contextual clue when using the past simple. If you do not indicate when something happened, use the present perfect for unspecified past. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. The go. In plus year slash month dot 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 yesterday dot 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 last week slash month slash year. When. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus past tense plus object s plus time expression. I went to the doctors yesterday. Negative. Subject plus did plus not didn't plus verb plus object s plus time expression. They didn't join us for dinner last week. Question. Question word plus did plus subject plus verb plus object s plus time expression. When did you buy that pullover? Past continuous for exact times in the past. Structure and usage. The past continuous tense is used to describe what was happening at a specific moment in the past. Do not use this form when referring to longer periods of time in the past such as last March, two years ago, etc. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. At 5.20, 3 o'clock, etc. Basic construction. Positive Subject plus was slash were plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. We were meeting with Jane at 2 o'clock yesterday afternoon. Negative. Subject plus was slash were plus not wasn't weren't plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. They weren't playing tennis at 5 o'clock on Saturday. Question Question word plus was slash were plus subject plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. What were you doing at 2.30 yesterday afternoon? Past continuous for interrupted action. Structure and usage. Use the past continuous to express what was happening when something important happened. This form is almost always used with the time clause when XYZ happened. It is also possible to use this form with while something was happening to express to past actions that were occurring simultaneously. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. When XYZ happened. While XYZ was happening. 
basic construction. Positive subject plus was slash were plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. Sharon was watching TV when she received the telephone call. Negative subject plus was slash were plus not wasn't weren't plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. We weren't doing anything important when you arrived. Question Question word plus was slash were plus subject plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. What were you doing when Tom gave you the bad news? Future was going to four future plans. The future was going to is used to express future plans or scheduled events. It is often used instead of the present continuous for future scheduled events. Either form can be used for this purpose. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. Next week slash month. Tomorrow. On Monday. Tuesday. Etc. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus B plus going to plus verb plus object S plus time expression. Tom is going to fly to Los Angeles on Tuesday. Negative. Subject plus be not isn't, aren't plus going to plus verb plus object s plus time expression. They aren't going to attend the conference next month. Question Question word plus b plus subject plus going to plus verb plus object s plus time expression. When are you going to meet Jack? Future with will for promises and predictions. Structure and usage. The future with will is used to make future predictions and promises. Often the precise moment the action will occur is unknown or not defined. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. Soon. Next month slash year slash week. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus will plus verb plus object s plus time expression. The government will increase taxes soon. Negative. Subject plus will not won't plus verb plus object s plus time expression. She won't help us much with the project. Question Question word plus will plus subject plus verb plus object s plus time expression. Why will they reduce taxes? Future was going to for future intent. Structure and usage. The future was going to is used for future intent or plans. You can express a future intent without expressing the exact time that something will occur. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. Next week slash month. Tomorrow. On Monday. Tuesday. Etc. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus B plus going to plus verb plus object S plus time expression. Anna is going to study medicine at university. Negative. Subject plus B not isn't. Aren't plus going to plus verb plus object S plus time expression. They aren't going to develop any new projects for the next few years. Question 
question word plus b plus subject plus going to plus verb plus object s plus time expression why are you going to change your job present perfect for past to present states and actions structure and usage Use of present perfect to express the state or repeated action that began in the past and continues into the present. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. For plus amount of time. Since plus specific point in time. Basic construction. Positive Subject plus have slash has plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. I have lived in Portland for four years. Negative. Subject plus have slash has not haven't hasn't plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. Max hasn't played tennis since 1999. Question Question word plus have slash has plus subject plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. Where have you worked since 2002? Present perfect to express recent events. Structure and usage. The present perfect is often used to express recent events that affect the present moment. These sentences often use the time expressions just, yet, already, or recently. If you give a specific time in the past, the past simple is required. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. Justy it already recently. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus have slash has plus just slash recently plus past participle plus object s. Henry has just gone to the bank. Negative. Subject plus have slash has not haven't. Hasn't plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. Peter hasn't finished his homework yet. Question Question word plus have slash has plus subject plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. Have you spoken to Andy yet? Present perfect for unspecified past events. Structure and usage. The present perfect is often used to express events that occurred in the past at an unspecified moment or cumulative life experiences up to the present. Remember that if you use a specific past time expression, choose the past simple. This tense is often used with the following time expressions twice, three times, four times, etc. Dot ever never. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus have slash has plus past participle plus object s. Peter has visited Europe three times in his life. Negative. Subject plus have slash has not haven't, hasn't plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. I haven't played golf many times. Question. Question word plus have slash has plus subject plus ever plus past participle plus object s. Have you ever been to France? Present perfect continuous. Structure and usage. 
The present perfect continuous is used to express how long a current activity has been going on. Remember that continuous forms can only be used with action verbs. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. Dot 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 since plus specific point in time. For plus amount of time. Basic construction. Positive subject plus has slash have plus been plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. He's been cleaning house for two hours. Negative. Subject plus has slash have not hasn't slash haven't plus been plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. Janice hasn't been studying for long. Question. Question word plus has slash have plus subject plus been plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. How long have you been working in the garden? Future perfect. Structure and usage. Use a future perfect tense to express what will have happened by a certain time in the future. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. By Monday, Tuesday, etc. By the time. By 5 o'clock, 2.30, etc. Basic construction. Positive subject plus will plus have plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. They will have finished the report by tomorrow afternoon. Negative. Subject plus will not won't plus have plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. Mary won't have answered all the questions by the end of this hour. Question Question word plus will plus subject plus have plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. What will you have done by the end of this month? Future perfect continuous. Structure and usage. The future perfect continuous is used to express the duration of an action up to a future point in time. This tense is not commonly used in English. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. By slash by the time. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus will plus have plus been plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. We will have been studying for two hours by the time he arrives. Negative. Subject plus will not won't plus have plus been plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. He won't have been working long by two o'clock. Question Question word plus will plus subject plus have plus been plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. How long will you have been working on that project by the time he arrives? Past perfect continuous. Structure and usage. The past perfect continuous is used to describe how long an activity had been going on before something else happened. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. For X hours, days, months, etc. Since Monday, Tuesday, etc. Basic construction. Positive. Subject plus had plus been plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. 
She had been waiting for two hours when he finally arrived. Negative. Subject plus had not hadn't plus been plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. They hadn't been working long when the boss asked them to change their focus. Question. Question word plus head plus subject plus bin plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. How long had Tom been working on that project then they decided to give it to Pete? Past perfect. Structure and usage. The past perfect is used to express something that happened before another point in time. It is often used to provide context for an explanation. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. Before ill radiance. Twice. Three times. Etc. By the time. Basic construction. Positive subject plus head plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. She had already eaten by the time the children came home. Negative subject plus had not hadn't plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. They hadn't finished their homework before the teacher asked them to hand it in. Question Question word plus head plus subject plus past participle plus object s plus time expression. Where had you gone before the class began? Future continuous. Usage and construction. The future continuous is used to talk about an activity that will be in progress at a specific point in time in the future. This tense is often used with the following time expressions. Dot 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 this time tomorrow slash next week. Month. Year dot 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 tomorrow slash Monday. Tuesday etc. slash at x o'clock into 3, 4, etc. slash weeks, months, years time. Basic construction. Positive subject plus will plus be plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. Peter will be doing his homework this time tomorrow. Negative. Subject plus will not won't plus be plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. Sharon won't be working in New York in three weeks time. Question. Question word plus will plus subject plus be plus verb plus ing plus object s plus time expression. What will you be doing this time next year?